Hello, this is just a quick one to explain how you change the skins on Fetus. Um, so I'll just start. This is a new one that I've done. And it's based on one of the ones that's already in there, which is um, IK3 VIG Special. Uh, so it's got his uh, button packs in there, but then it's got a different background um, skin, the console they call it, and it's got a different um, kind of image on the back there. Uh, as you can see, I've called it G0XB World because it's got a picture of um, the world behind it, So, but it's quite nice. Um, anyway, let me show you how you do it. So basically, you've got to go into the folder system, um, local disk, users, um, then you go into your username, then you've got to find app data. Um, if you can't see it, if you go to view and make sure that the hidden items uh, box is ticked, it should then show because it's a hidden folder. Um, roaming, open HPSDR skins, and then the title of the um, one that you want to change. The best thing to do, let me go into here and show you. The best thing to do, here's the list of them, is to copy one of these. Um, just copy the whole folder, copy and then paste it back into here and then work on that one so you're not messing around with ones that already exist and therefore if you've got any faults, you know, you can revert back. So um, I'll show you on this one. So you go into that, there's only one folder in there, console, and then you'll see these are all the kind of graphics for the buttons etc that are in there um, if you go to pick display which is here as you can see i've lobbed a few in that's the standard one that comes with this um, that i've um, changed and that's the new one that i've put in uh, the the system itself will actually auto stretch it for you but the important thing is it has to be a PNG file. So you can drop, drag and drop anything you want into here. As long as you call it, pick display exactly the same as that uh, with a capital D, the, uh, the system will find it. Um, obviously, you can't have two of them. One other thing is whenever you do any of this, you can't have Thetis open. You've got to close Thetis. So let's do that now. Um, and then we can we can amend things. Um, so pick display is the background image of the um, what do you call it that the the display for waterfall etc. And then console is the background in, image of the entire um, software basically the entire skin. As you can see, I've just uh, loaded a um, one that I'd. Um, kind of found I actually found this off the internet it's just a kind of aluminium look sort of background which looks pretty nice again remember this has got to be a PNG file the quickest way of making a JPEG a PNG is open it with paint um, I'll show you and then simply immediately save as and then it gives you the option and then choose PNG and then the file name and then you can you can convert anything into PNG then and then drop it into this folder. So let me show you one that I'm playing with now. I want to change the um, TX button on here to be red when you transmit rather than blue. So they've got blue. As you can see, there's a, a zero and a one state for each button. So zero is just a black button and then one and these ones are all blue, but I want the TX one to be red. So what I've done I've got to go and find it now, haven't I? Should be easy because they're all blue. Um, I think I've I think I've saved it in here. Ah, there it is. I, I've I've opened one up. Um, I've modified it so it's red. I've, currently, I've called it Mox Two because I'm going to rename this one. So what I'll do is, I'll uh, at the moment this is the Mox button. I'll do the TX one after. I'm going to rename this one uh, Three, for instance, and then we're going to rename this one back to one um, and then that will be whenever the state of that button goes to one it'll um, it'll be red instead so all i need to do now that's saved is reopen thetis 
and hopefully when I uh, hit the MOX button that should be red. Uh, I'm also going to do it for the transmit button but it's exactly the same process. Waiting for it to start, mine's very slow. Right, there we go, here's the new, let's start it up, but then mute it, and then hit MOX, and it's red, there you go, that's how you do it. So that is how you change the skins and the buttons in uh, Thetis. I hope that was useful, cheers.